begin this test, take an, an electronic balance, zero it, and measure the mass of your tachometer. Record this value. Next, fill the pycnometer with the aired water up to the neckline. Be very precise when doing this. Next, return to the electronic balance and zero it. Once zeroed, measure the mass of the whole pycnometer. Record this value and subtract the previous value to obtain the weight of the water. Next, measure the temperature of the full pycnometer. Be sure to leave the thermometer in for two minutes so to obtain an accurate reading. Return to the electronic balance and zero it. Take the mass of a small to medium sized bowl. Record this value. Next, use the electronic balance to measure out 75 plus or minus 10 grams of soil. Next, pour some water out of your pycnometer. Next, fill the pycnometer with your soil sample. Use the aired water to wash the sides. Make sure all of the soil sample has settled at the bottom. After the sides are clear, continue to fill the pycnometer until it reaches the neckline. Next, use the aired water to fill the pycnometer back up to the edge mark. Be sure to be precise. Bring your pycnometer to the vacuum. Insert the plastic tube into the pycnometer. Turn the vacuum on and leave the vacuum on for 10 minutes, all while shaking the pycnometer and soil sample. Finally, return to the electronic balance and measure the mass of your pycnometer. Then, return to the vacuum machine and repeat the process. Finally, return to the electronic balance and measure the mass of your pycnometer one final time. Record this value. Then record a final temperature. Next, you take the mass of a rectangular tray. Record this value. Pour the contents of the pycnometer into the tray. Use more de aired water to rinse all contents out of the pycnometer. Take the tray and place it in the oven. Leave the tray in there to dry for approximately 24 hours. Remove the tray from the oven. Bring the tray to the electronic balance to measure its mass. Yes, yes. Oh, that's pretty good. Yeah, Record yeah, this value. Yeah.